So um, we're going to start this uh, Zoom session. Today, it's about um, something big is coming uh, in trend to metaverse, the hibernation. Uh, without further ado, let me introduce the speaker for this session, which is a Gorgeous Secret and Crypto Sabah. They will do the uh, presentation for you. And during this time, um, well, let's just focus on the PPT, the presentation. Uh, I will basically mute everyone in this room so that um, we can have this Zoom run smoothly. And I wish that you would just uh, focus on the topic for today. All right. So sit back and relax. Let me introduce them. Gorgeous Secret and Crypto Saba. The floor is yours. Thank you. Thank you, Jean. Hey, thanks for the... I host, can I? Let me kill the music first. Yeah, yep. And let me share the screen. Huh? Hey, welcome, welcome to our session. Hey. Hey, it's another Zoom okay, for us okay, to meet each other and then we can communicate hey, about hypernation. Hey, so today's topic is about really about hypernation. Hey, so something big is coming, and everyone by now should know that hypernation is our next big project. Hey, and you would like to actually know what is the real thing and the also okay like the gist and also the content like about hypernation. All right, let's take a look at what we have like prepared like for you. Okay, sit back and relax. Like, let's go. Uh, today, we are going to talking about the in-trend like beyond Metaverse. Metaverse, as you see, uh, is formed by two words, Meta and Universe. And by now, like because of Facebook changing their parents' name, parents' company name to Meta, that is where like a lot of people get attention like to know more about Metaverse. Uh, but in Hypernation, we are talking about way beyond Metaverse. Like it's a multiverse like kind of like nation where we have the same philosophy and the consensus of economy like to work together like, in the same universe. Like, this is just like a Dr. Strange too or what? And something big, of course, is coming. And the content like of today, we are talking, we are going to start with trend 2021 like, to and 2022. And number two, we are going to talk about decentralized. And number three, is going to be a metaverse. Metaverse is not limited to games. A lot of people out there might be thinking of metaverse is only for games. Of course, the gamers community, the numbers of gamers actually make up the like, hip about this metaverse gaming like industry. And number four, what is the hibernation philosophy? And number five, we talk about the future development in hibernation that will be using okay, like XR. MR and AI technology, of course, with some examples uh, will be given to you. And number six, the globalization involvement of hibernation. How does hibernation change the current situation and the current suffering that we are going through? Food shortages, economic crisis, uh, that is what we are facing now. So how does hibernation uh, improve our living in this aspect? And number seven, like UBI, Universal Basic Income, is a form of fair dissemination of wealth. That means by like, using the crypto like, theories, we talk about COW, like the proof of work. Uh, that means you contribute more than you earn more. But here in hibernation, like in the beginning, we are giving you the best like, that you can imagine. You give less, but we are, we are going to give you more. Uh, so we are going to introduce our hypernation packages. That is what I just talked about it. I give less uh, that we take. And all this uh, theory and philosophy will put like, into action that will create the butterfly effect uh, through your actions like, to taking part of it. And of course, number 10. After listening like, to the whole presentation, what is your call to action? That means 
you will have to step up like from your comfort zone like and join in the bandwagon of the hibernation like in like for us like to move together like to a even higher like stronger like and better nation like are you ready so okay let's go like we talk about the trend like nowadays like the trend nowadays is about like metaverse of course metaverse now the picture that you see here like is using the vr headset like the vr headset I don't talk about the heaviness. Okay, like it's talking about the pricey. Okay, like of this particular like headset. Like so, we hope that like the big guy out there, like no matter it's Meta, Microsoft, like Google, like they can make it like be a mass production for everyone that can enjoy like this metaverse experience together. We are going to do. We are going to do just stop by watching movie, the Ready Player One, okay, like the free guy okay, like kind of things. Uh -huh. Right, so and if you are fancy of buying lands, buying property, like welcome to this central land. Right, so that is buying virtual land and piece of property like in this central land. That actually make crypto and also NFT so like in this like metaverse. Right, so crypto okay, like started like in 2008. That was 14 years ago. And NFT started a few years back. Right, that is where like the progress is moving on to create a better universe for us in the metaverse. And of course, last year when Facebook announced that, Mark Zuckerberg announced that uh, his is going to change to, from Facebook like, to Meta, that is where we know that the big thing is, is really like coming. If you like to play games uh, and even you are children, like underage, welcome to Roblox. Right, that is where we have our entertainment and also our leisure time. Right, so this picture, the whole picture actually shows you that metaverse is really more than games, more than work. Like it's everything inside. It's the parallel world in the other side of our real world that is living in. It's just that we will be fantasizing. We will have a more perfect like, and fulfilling like, world out there. Okay, thank you very much for the share, Mr. Gorgeous Secret. So before we delve deeper into hypernation, let us take a look at some simple definitions of what is a metaverse. Like Gorgeous Secret mentioned just now, ever since Facebook changed its name to Meta, metaverse has been one of the hottest thing on people's mouth. Okay, so what is basically a metaverse? Metaverse in simple definition is a futuristic digital world where people can interact in a virtual and augmented reality. It is a network of 3D worlds where your vision in a least reality can come true. Okay, so what can you do in the metaverse? Gorgeous Secret also mentioned just now that we will explain further that metaverse is not just for gaming because in the metaverse, whatever that you deem is an activity that you would want to do is possible. Okay, for example, let us take a look at one movie that explains this. So if you guys have not seen this movie yet, Ready Player One by Steven Spielberg. If you haven't watched this, go watch it. And then your idea and your interpretation of Metaverse will be vast. Okay, whatever happens in this movie is exactly what can happen and have already happened in the metaverse. Apart from Ready Player One, you can watch Ryan Reynolds' recent movie, The Free Guy, and also the famous Altered Carbon uh, Netflix series. Okay, so moving on to the next one. What is a metaverse? If we ask ourselves, what do we want from a metaverse? Is metaverse a brand new world? Is Metaverse a game? Just a game? Or is Metaverse the future? A new way of human lives? Ask yourself, what is a Metaverse? And what can I do in the Metaverse? I will pass it back to Mr. Gorgeous Secret. Hey, thanks, Crypto Sabbath. That will actually open up your mind. Like, what is really a Metaverse? If you watch 
Ready Player One, that sounds like a real world combined with a game. Right? So what is the new way of life? Like, let's take a look at it. So this is like the immersive feeling that we would like to have when we go inside like a metaverse. Right? Just like the movie Avatar. Right? Of course, we heard about this word Avatar more often like when NFT was introduced like to us like in like the like we call it blockchain world or the crypto world. Okay, so if you were to actually have a full immersive feeling inside the metaverse, like this is how like the thing is going to look like. Right? And of course, we will hope that the big tech guy like that is developing the technology right now can really give us like some feeling like, like that. Of course, nowadays, after the like COVID bloody years. Like along, like we have we have missed okay, like the feeling of going inside the cinema. And people are changing their way of watching movies, like it's streaming on Netflix, like or something. But going inside a cinema to feel the 3D, the IMAX kind of feeling, like is tremendous, like it's uncomparable like to the feeling that you are watching it at home. Like so that is why like the immersive feeling like of living like in a parallel world in metaverse is so much like fantasy like to our real world now and talking about like the fantasy like of the metaverse let us introduce our own like metaverse that is hypernation hypernation of course like, when you first read the name it sounds like hypertension okay <laughs> so like will you be very very excited to like, to know okay, like, what is like a hypernation? So hypernation is a nation built without any restriction and borders. So the world now that like, we are living in like either are controlled by politicians or either are controlled by selfish leaders. Uh, that's what a lot of people might be thinking of. These things are no longer needed for mankind to push past their limits uh, because in a free world we will realize our true potential. Superficial boundaries and differences will be stripped away. So everyone will be treated like the same. So if you can perform like better, like you live better. And most importantly, you can live like what like you want like to be. And the only thing remaining is a place where everyone is treated equally. That's what we want, right? Regardless of race, language, and religion. We don't want all this right, to actually uh, kidnapping like us right, from the real like me or I like we are living in. Hypernation will be the stalwart like defenders of liberty and freedom. So we make sure that everyone getting into the hypernation will be treated like fairly. And the next generation like of us will be having a much like better like living. And talking about the hypernation, like we mentioned just now, hypernation is not only confined to metaverse, it's more than like a bigger universe like inside the metaverse. The metaverse is just one of the hypernation portals. So that is why when you look at like one of our corroboration, the like partners, hyper NFT, like is also part like of the hypernation. To think of hypernation as a super large 3D virtual game, like is one sided. Like, so, again, metaverse and hypernation is not uh, a game. Hypernation is a new digital civilization that integrates a variety of new technologies. Like, we want to live and we rely a lot on technologies. Like, so, when these two humanized factor and technology blend together, that is where we enjoy the best like, of life. It involves multiple elements such as sovereign wealth. Right? So wealth can be distributed equally, ecologically, like construction, that we can preserve like the nature and live happily every after, like, together with the environment that we are living in. Economic system, like we will have a consensus, consensus of it, like this one, we will talk about it later. And of course, the value setting. Like we welcome everyone that accepts like the philosophy in hyphenation, like to live together and we work like to a better living. It is a high dimensional expansion of natural persons. Unleash your potential 
within. And like, we would like to invite, invite our host, Jean, to play a hibernation video like, for us. Thanks, Jean. So yes, that is basically a glimpse of what you will get in hibernation. So doesn't that look interesting? Doesn't that look futuristic? And isn't there somewhere that you feel you want to belong in? Okay, let me just go through what is the mission of hibernation. We would like to aim for the integration of MR, mixed reality, extended reality, and the uh, adoption of artificial intelligence. When it comes to mixed reality, we would like to apply mixed reality to enhance the living standards of humans across the globe within hypernation, making it a more immersive and interacting experience for the citizens. For extended reality, we would like to bring perfection into hypernation by striving to give you all the citizens of hypernation an experience through all the five senses through smell through vision through auditory through touch anything that you can think of we aim to provide you with that citizens of hypernation and of course the adoption of artificial intelligence inside hypernation will be an extensive application of the automation of free humanity which is earlier on we mentioned the aim of hypernation the ethos of hypernation is to give equality and fairness so by adoption of artificial intelligence we are able to allow individuals to pursue self-actualization rather than languishing in constant work for survival when it comes to our long-term goals we are touching on three pillars which is first your personal goal what do you want to achieve in hibernation? We can provide a spiritual framework that is attached to a liberation to liberate your minds from the yoke of slavery and oppression that you might or may have experienced in a previous life or in your previous years. We also strive to achieve a so social goal when it comes to bringing humans together creating a community of people with equal and fair rights that we aim to eradicate all stereotypes, status and classes. So this means regardless of your skin color, regardless of your orientation, regardless of your background, everyone in hypernation is safe. And lastly, of course, our goal is to provide an overall nation of utopia championing human rights and furthering the advancement of the human race through what through the creation of uninhibited unhi utopia where everyone can have their own place in it together with the people they love okay gorgeous secret would you like to share more on the concept of hypernation Okay, thank you, Krito Sabat. Okay, so that is the mission and goal right, of hibernation. 
this is a Zoom okay, like where we communicate like our concept like to all our future hibernation potential citizen. So, okay, just hold on like, because we are going to tell you that like, how are you going to get your citizen fast like into hibernation? So the concept of decentralization will form the basic concept of the whole hibernation. Decentralization or decentralization like, is the process by which the activities of an organization, particularly those regarding planning and decision-making are distributed or delegated away from a central authoritative location or group. So what does it mean? It just tells you that we are governing each other, but not exactly. We don't, we don't restrict right, the other people not doing something or doing something. Right? So we just want to come like, to a same consensus that right, everybody working towards like, a better future. Right? So it's just, just not like your husband or wife are controlling you like, at home. Right? So we don't hope that the whole nation will be controlled by a group of people. We hope that everybody will come like, to live here and enjoy life here. And also, we are working towards the same goal. In blockchain, decentralization refers to the transfer of control and decision-making from a centralized entity. Either it's an individual organization or a group that of, to a distributed network. This is a whole concept of decentralization because even like in the, either in the communist, communist community or either in the democratic community, we found that the centralized management and planning is just not what we want. So therefore, we create a lot of youngsters that go inside like crypto world or blockchain like technology was hoping that like, we will achieve something out of this decentralization. Like, that means everybody will have the same thought, the same consensus that we can work towards a better nation. Right. So therefore, in hibernation, the basic right, of the decentralization concept we are having is going through a globalization. That means everybody all become one, like one as all. And through our universal basic income, therefore, we can let everyone to be treated like fairly and you will be having your own happily ever after life in the, the hibernation. So to talk about this one, the universal basic income, what we are looking at, we are offering the best opportunity for you. We invite you to become a proud citizen in hibernation, where you enjoy unique social status. That means you don't have to be a minister you don't have to be a VIP in order for you to enjoy that kind of social status. And particularly when you are working towards the same goal with hibernation, you will enjoy fantastic rewards. Okay, so this is what we like. After our childhood time, like maybe in, during our teenager time or during our working life, we feel like the rewards is getting lesser and lesser. Okay, therefore, in hibernation, we will, we will complete okay, like this rewards like system for you to feel like you are rewarded in everything that you are doing. And therefore, we go towards a much more fulfilling life. Like, so how do we actually get ourselves a citizen pass? Like, perhaps Crypto Sabbath, like you would like to tell us more about this one. Okay, thank you very much, Gorgeous Secret. Yes, I would very much would love to tell everyone here how you can achieve, uh, obtain your citizen pass. So in front here, we offer three packages with three different uh, pricing with, that comes with three different benefits. So first, firstly, package A, the price that is placed is 400 USDT with a projected value of reward of 1,200 HU. So the projected uh, rewards will be in hyper units, right? So package B, the pricing would be at 1,200 USDT with the projected value reward of 3,600 HU 
And for the last package, the most premium package is priced at 4,800 USDT with an ultimate projection value of rewards of 14,400 HU. Alright, so these are the prices that is on offer. Why do you need to get it now? Why is now the right time? Because as you all know, we are in the bear market. The crypto market right now is not doing too good. It's not very healthy. It's the bear market. So when is the best time to invest? It is now. Buy the dip so that you can sell your profits later on. We practice a, a concept of give and take. Okay, You give now, later on you will take more than what you are giving. And of course, we would like to implore the butterfly effect. You join in and you advocate this to the people around you so that you would also provide them with the equal opportunity, the equal profits that they can achieve as much as you can. So now is the time. Do not wait. Now it's during the bear market. It's the time for you to buy. Where can you get access to hypernation? Easy. So what you can do is head over to www.hypernation.io. As you can see in front here, there's an example of the uh, cover for hypernation. As you go to this page, you would like to then go to connect to hypernation. And then this will bring you to our other website that will allow you to purchase your citizenship. Okay, so in order for you to immerse yourself deeper into hypernation, do visit the website. Or you can, once you uh, get to the website, you will get to our landing page, which is hypernation, h5.hypernation.io. And then you can register and log in and enjoy your journey from there. So, to, in a way, to finish our session for today, don't fall, uh, forget to follow us on our social media. We are on Discord and also on Twitter. Scan the QR in front here and get on with the team. Get uh, on board and join us in Hypernation. And we would like me, Gorgeous Secret, and also Ice, your MC for today, would like to welcome you all on board the new world of hypernation, your future home. Thank you very much.